okay, I wanted to do the uh, 50 millimeter test again because the last one wasn't quite in focus. Um, it's a manual focus lens, so as a kind of stick, boom, stick out there, focus it roughly at what I'm standing. I'm using the, uh, the ceiling light as kind of a, a guide of where to stand. <clears throat> this is a uh, Pentec 50mm 1.4. It's an older Pentec M phone, which is the late 70s, early 80s. And, uh, I actually like it quite a bit for um, video uh, on this uh, Olympus EP3. Uh, you'll notice from some of my um, family videos in the last week or so, uh, I was using this lens, especially in natural light, because you know, especially when I pop it open at 1.4. Uh, the only downside, of course, is you have to manually focus, which is not exactly easy when it comes to our kids. Um, however, the older manual focus lenses are designed primarily for manually focusing, so it makes it a lot easier to get a grip on that focus ring and just kind of smoothly move it back and forth. Um, in the 17mm uh, 2.8 video, which you might have not seen yet, the autofocus on that is actually quite horrendous. Um, but you can actually turn off the autofocus and just choose to uh, manually focus that, although it takes uh, quite a bit more turns to uh, focus that in and out. Uh, you can change in the menu which direction to turn for near and far, but you can't adjust uh, how much to focus with the amount of turning. Um, right now, I am using uh, two strobes, uh, one behind me flushing the wall out, and the, the one right here on the right side of me with a, um, a cheap umbrella style softbox. I don't know if you can see the catch light in my eyes. Uh, and my walls are actually quite this orange. I just kind of got the, but, um, the, the modeling lamp behind me kind of flooded it out a little bit. Uh, they're not ideal for video, uh, especially considering they're not very powerful and the, um, the light um, will fluctuate a little bit, you know, based on the um, power being given to the uh, strobe. Uh, it'll actually dim from time to time when it's um, telling you that the capacitor is charged and such. And uh, right now the camera is recording in uh, manual mode um, at 1 of a second at uh, f5.6 on the lens itself and uh, ISO 1600. In the 17mm uh, uh, demo, uh, I have that at 1 60th of a second um, at f4. Uh, but I wanted to give myself a, a little more depth of field with the 50mm uh, since uh, I can't easily predict where to stand with it. <clears throat> with the crop factor, it's uh, almost like shooting with a 100mm line, but the, uh, the depth of field wouldn't be as shallow though. 